Imagine a world where the giants of the past roam the earth once again, where the line between the ancient and the modern blurs. Let's delve into the possibilities of cloning dinosaurs. The prospect of cloning dinosaurs has captivated the imagination. Ever since the publication of Michael Creighton's Jurassic Park and its subsequent film adaptations, the idea taps into both our deep fascination with these ancient creatures and our equally profound concerns about the ethical and practical implications of such a feat. If we could clone dinosaurs, the repercussions would span scientific, ecological, ethical, and economic realms, each with its complex set of considerations. The initial achievement of cloning dinosaurs would represent a monumental leap in genetic engineering and paleontology. Scientists would have overcome significant obstacles, such as extracting viable DNA from fossils millions of years old, a feat currently deemed impossible due to DNA's degradation over time. This breakthrough could potentially extend to cloning other extinct species, offering a revolutionary tool for biodiversity conservation and the study of evolution. However, the scientific community would face immediate challenges. Would cloned dinosaurs be authentic replicas of their ancient counterparts? Or would they be modern interpretations filled in with the DNA of contemporary species? The environment has also drastically changed since the Mesozoic era, raising questions about the cloned dinosaur's ability to survive or their need for human-made environments similar to those created for zoo animals. Introducing dinosaurs into modern ecosystems could have unpredictable and possibly catastrophic effects. These ancient predators and herbivores have no place in today's food webs, and their presence could threaten existing species and disrupt ecological balances. Conservationists would be tasked with the complex decision of whether to contain these creatures in controlled environments or to attempt integration into the wild, both options fraught with ethical and practical dilemmas. The ethics of cloning dinosaurs would be a hotly debated topic. Beyond the could we lies the more profound question of should we? The welfare of the cloned dinosaurs themselves would be of paramount concern, including their physical and psychological well-being in environments, vastly different from their original habitats. Moreover, the potential suffering and extinction of species that might result from their introduction would pose serious moral questions. The debate would also extend to the implications for human society. The power to resurrect extinct species places immense responsibility on scientists and policymakers to consider the long-term consequences of their actions. Not just the immediate allure of scientific achievement, the possibility of seeing live dinosaurs would undoubtedly have massive appeal, likely leading to the creation of theme parks or reserves akin to the fictional Jurassic Park. This would generate significant economic opportunities, from tourism and education to media and merchandise. However, the commercialization of cloned dinosaurs raises concerns about their treatment and the ethics of using these creatures for entertainment and profit. The cloning and potential commercial exploitation of dinosaurs would necessitate a new legal framework to address ownership, rights, and responsibilities. Regulations would need to cover everything from the treatment of these animals to the safety of the public. The risk of accidents or escapes could pose significant dangers, requiring strict security measures and emergency protocols. The ability to see and study live dinosaurs would profoundly impact our culture and our understanding of history and science. It could inspire a new generation of scientists, much as the Apollo missions inspired interest in space exploration. However, it might also lead to disillusionment or ethical concerns about humanity's dominion over nature and the lengths to which we are willing to go in the name of progress.